Well, hey there. Today we are going to be talking about some kennel cough symptoms uh, that you need to watch out for. Okay, so obviously we all keep dogs for different reasons. Some of us keep them as pets and some of you may keep them for protection purposes. But whatever your reason is for having uh, your pet, the health concerns of your animal are obviously very important. Now, not a single in individual would want to see his pet suffer from any ailment. In addition to this, pet illnesses can be very costly. As you know, most medical care for dogs and other animals typically come directly out of a pet owner's pocketbook. Okay, It is therefore very important for us pet owners to ensure that they uh, you know, that we're vigilant in protecting our pets from being infected, okay? An illness like kennel cough is one that may sound horrific to pet owners, but it's actually not that serious by nature. Because of this, knowing the proper treatment for kennel cough and kennel cough symptoms can save you a lot of money in the long term, okay? So kennel cough symptoms in dogs can be detected within about three days after your pet has actually contracted the, uh, the disease. So some of the symptoms uh, may include some of the following, okay? So you might hear a dry and callous cough, uh, snorting and retching after exercise, uh, maybe some sneezing uh, or some discharge of some liquid out of the eye, and also uh, a runny nose, okay? So the above symptoms usually last for about 10 to 20 days. Also, fevers can be detected in some dogs, especially those infected at such a young age. And actually, the most up-to-date research indicates that the infection that causes kennel cough may also put dogs at a high risk of contracting pneumonia. It's because of these reasons that us dog owners are advised to ensure that their dogs are provided with um, extra care, okay? So lack of knowledge about this disease has led some people believing that it can lead to death, when ultimately the only fear about this disease that we should <clears throat> base our facts on is that it actually makes dogs more vulnerable to other ailments. That's why it's very important to get this taken care of, okay? So kennel cough itself does not lead to death. This does not mean that it should not be taken seriously, however. So learning about different home remedies now can be used uh, for preventing and curing this particular disease. So just below uh, this video for you, I've actually got a link for you that will talk about some different home remedies that you can use for kennel cough and some other treatments that you can use. So if you're looking to uh, help treat some of those symptoms of your dog's kennel cough, then just click the link below this video. And thanks for watching and have a great day.